Results are still pouring in for the 2020 presidential election, and central Wisconsinites made sure their voices were heard by casting their ballots yesterday. Thanks for joining us. I'm Phil Aldrich. And I'm Melissa Langman. Our team does have you covered tonight. First, let's start out with News 9's Victoria Saha. She has more on the record-breaking voter turnout. A lot of clerks in our area predicted that this was going to be one election where a lot of voters showed up to cast their ballots. And they weren't wrong. Though the nation is in the middle of a global pandemic, it's not just COVID-19 cases breaking records in Wisconsin. It's also voter turnout. Far the, the largest anything in our, on our record. Starting back to early voting, 1.9 million Wisconsinites cast their ballot even before the November election. Um, within a week of the election, it was already at 40 percent um, ballots being returned and had surpassed the, the 2016 uh, turnout for absentee voting, at least by about 4,000. And now that election day is over, we have the numbers for voter turnout in central Wisconsin. So it was busy, um, but otherwise it was a really smooth day and I'm uh, very pleased with the turnout. As you can see in this graph, seven of our counties reporting more than 90% of voter turnout. Wapaka and Lincoln County reporting over 70% voter turnout. I expected a large turnout. I didn't think we'd hit the 90 mark, to be truthfully honest. I figured high 80s, you know, somewhere in there. But yeah, 91.65, incredible. Over in Wood County, Clerk Trent Minor says in the 2016 election, they had just about 85% voter turnout, which they thought back then was huge. I, I'm blown away by the turnout. It, it, it's really cool to see that kind of turnout for a presidential, um, and it's good. I, that, that's the way it should be. It should actually be 100%, but we'll take the 91.65 any day of the week. Now, the clerks I spoke to didn't say specifically if a certain city or municipality had a high or low turnout, but overall, they are very pleased. Now, counties will start their canvassing and will certify their numbers to the state next week. In Weston, Victoria Saha, News 9 WAOW.